Sir, what are you talking about? You sound so dumb. Sorry? You sound so dumb. Yeah, well, I believe that camel urine is healthy, <laughs> and you are the smart. You know why? You, I'll, I'll tell you why you sound dumb. You know why? Mm -hmm. He says, stop. He said, Muhammad called Allah the most merciful. Do you know what the most merciful means? Where it says the most merciful? The most merciful means the most merciful is the most Rahman is the most merciful. Okay, but why this is time the first time Muhammad using the word Ar Rahman? Do you know? Because Allah calls himself Ar Rahman. You have to read. Where, Allah where, where? Hold on, no, 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 no. Read with really me carefully. The people they say they never heard him saying before the word Ar Rahman. Suddenly Muhammad saying Ar Rahman. Today in the Quran, yes, in every, in every chapter. Okay, let me ask you then. If this is the first time Muhammad he mentioned the word Ar Rahman. Why we find in every chapter in the Quran, in the beginning, verse number one, it says, in the name of Allah, Ar-Rahman, Ar-Rahim. So this is a corruption. This is the first time Muhammad received this. First of all, you have to understand that the Quran is not from Muhammad. It's from Allah himself. This is, this is the question. If, if it is from Allah, how come this is the first time Muhammad using that word? How That's mean Muhammad never said to uh, Allah never said to him before that word, because this is the first time. This is the chapter 17, verse number 1, 110. According to Revelation, what is the number of chapter chapter 17? I don't know. So what do you think? What is the reason? For revealing the most merciful? No. Why Muhammad never mentioned the word Ar-Rahman before? To the point Muhammad everybody around him. The one who's <coughs> mentioning the stuff in the Quran is Allah. And it doesn't matter. Okay. Why Allah did not? Because people, they will hear it from Muhammad at the end. It's what Allah. I'm asking you. Why Muhammad never said the, the word Ar-Rahman before? You are reading the Surah, Surah Al-Isra, the end of the ayah. I am, I I am ayah. asking you why Muhammad did not say the word Ar-Rahman before. Do you know what this is? Do you, do you know? Do you know what this chapter is? Yes, yeah, Surah Isra. Okay. So this is when when this happened to Muhammad. Surah Isra is the Surah that Isra is the, the taken to the um, Bani Okay. Isra what is the number of this chapter? I think it is. I'm guessing it is 17 or 18. No, the real number is 50. <laughs> yes, no, 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 this is, no, no, I, I don't say lies, my friend. Is, you Muslim, you, you lie always. Al Isra okay. is number 50. This is the truth. According to Revelation, according to your Muslims uh, uh, reference, this is chapter number 50. That's mean Muhammad never mentioned the word Ar Rahman until half of the Quran. So he received half of the Quran already and he never said the word Ar Rahman to the point people they were saying to him Who is Ar Rahman? You are worshiping to God now? So then he said no, Allah he gave him this is Surah 17. No, it's chapter no. of you see because you are ignorant all Muslims are ignorant No, it's Surah okay. What, what if I got you busted you want to get you busted? Not only get me busted show me everything. No problem. Here we go. This is what we do this I'm this is why I'm a Christian Prince and you are not Mr. Prince, may Allah guide you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Allah guide no one. Don't you see? Don't you know may that Allah? Allah don't you know Allah that Allah? Allah, Allah he said he is the one who must guide. Here we go. Al Isra no. is number four, seven, seventeen. It's number fifty. Do you see it? <laughs> you just got caught in your own saying. Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you, you see it? Caught, it is number uh, fifty. Do you see it? Where? Ah, uh, so the Isra. Yeah. It's number 50 on the list. It's number 17. Number, I no, number 50 in the list according to Revelation. This is the website here. This is Islamic website. Are you all right? Show you, showing you according to Revelation order. <laughs> according to Revelation order. Now you are reading the book according to Uthman. So according to Allah, this is chapter number 50. So your prophet, he received 50 chapter. Yet he never mentioned the word Ar-Rahman yet. And this is the first time. Explain that to me. The Quran, okay. Could I ask you one question? No, don't ask me, my friend. I have no answer. You are the you are the one. You, you said okay, I am I dumb. You said I am stupid. First you said I'm. So you are the one who can answer. How Muhammad no, never mentioned no, the word Rahman? After fifty chapter, half of the Quran, he have already half of the Quran, and yet he never mentioned the word Rahman yet. Okay, can I answer? Go ahead. Okay, first of all, you guys have to realize that the Quran, he who are min Rahman, he it is from the most merciful. Who are Rahman <laughs> is Allah is the most merciful. This is so not the question, Allah Abdul. This is not the question. Why Muhammad never mentioned the word Ar Rahman? Fifty chapter is gone. Fifty chapter of the Quran, and yet Muhammad never Allah. mentioned that there is a name for Allah. His name Ar Rahman. Allah.
I don't hear you. What? Because Allah did not mention it. Allah. Thank you, guys. Did you, did you hear? Did you hear him saying it? Allah did not mention it because Allah did mention did not mention it. Thank you very much. That's mean the Quran is a corrupt book. Because we find in every verse in those 50 chapter every Quran we find it says in Bismillah rahman rahim So if Allah never mentioned that word Ar-Rahman before that mean all those chapters before this chapter should not have the word Ar-Rahman But all of them they have Ar-Rahman Yeah, well it you have are you going to go to, are you going to go to sleep now are you going to go to sleep never mentioned it before you just said you just said because Allah never mentioned it before I agree with you no he never mentioned it before and you agree you agreed with me that's wonderful now I'm asking you so why all the verses have the word ar-Rahman or the chapter if this is the first time ar-Rahman appear I talk about this, this guy he do not know what I'm talking about now he played dumb you see he called me he called me he called me dumb but now he is playing literally dumb now he do not know I'm talking about what all right am I heard all right yes go ahead so what do you want to say to us Okay, so first for 50 chapter is gone and yet your prophet never received the word ar-rahman how do you explain that to us go ahead okay. first of all ar-rahman is one of the names of allah you know that you no problem this is, this is what you are saying your prophet he stole the name of ar-rahman from someone else so now i'm asking you oh here is saying he's from? who's saying that the hadith yeah. the, 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 the 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 book of asbab al nuzul my friend, are you are you are you with me or not? I'm asking you. According to your book, Muhammad never said the word Ar Rahman before until this chapter. And this is in the front of you. This is the book of Asbab al Nuzul. Do you see it? And this is your translation, and this is your Islamic website. This is the official government website of the Kingdom of Jordan. Okay. So according to your books. This is the first time Muhammad he said the word Ar Rahman. So people they were wondering what happened to Muhammad? Why he is saying Ar Rahman? He used to say Allah before only. Now maybe he is worshiping two gods. Because the other one we know, his name Ar Rahman, is the Rahman of Musaylama. Your prophet he stole Ar Rahman from Musaylama. So I'm asking you, I showed you the reference. The first time your prophet he got that, and then we showed you. How that the first time Muhammad he got that is in chapter of Isra, which is a chapter number 50. And you agreed with that. Now, so how you explain to me that every chapter in the Quran today have Bismillah Rahman Rahim? If this is the first time Muhammad received the word of Rahman. Okay, 29, 29 surahs came down with Bismillah Rahman Rahim. One surah did not come down, and that is Surah Tawbah. You know, but this will mean that's a lie. That's a lie because according to your revelation. The, uh, the, the Quran according to revelation that you're a prophet you received that as number 50 which means after 50 chapter is passed what 50 chapter are you talking about aren't you the one who said to me before this is the reason because because he never received it before aren't you the one who said to me he did not mention it before because he never have it before you forgot what you said to me yes I mean are you serious did you forgot I think you forgot no. I don't forget. Okay, so I am asking you now. Because why you're a prophet? Why I answer, please? Why you're a prophet? Never mentioned that before. Because the story you are reading instructed him to say the name. What? Uh, what? Uh, what the name? What the name? What do you mean? Surah Isra. Surah Isra instructed the prophet to use Ar Rahman. Okay. And I just ruined your whole discussion. No, That's no, no, hold on, hold on. They never heard it before. What do you mean to so before he never used it? But they, but, okay, so I'll so he, he so hold on, hold on. So the Quran, according to Revelation, saying that he got that after 50 chapter. Did you go to the last last verse on that surah? Finish this one first, and we can go to any verse you want. No, that's the one. That's the one on the same surah. On the same surah, it tells him to use the word Ar-Rahman. 
doesn't matter. Here, here your prophet, he explained why. why. He says, he hold on. It. The verse in the front of you, it says, I call him a Rahman or I call him Allah. All the good names belong to Allah. It doesn't matter. And then... No, that's what, that's what you don't understand. Uh, this is the first time they're telling him to use the name. My friend, no, no problem. I'm going with you. He told him to this use the name. You know the but this is Muhammad is claiming that. Muhammad is claiming that Allah told him that he was answering people. Why you are saying a Rahman? Don't you no, read? Are you blind? Prophet. Are you blind, my friend? It says in the front of you, you're yes, a prophet. Yes, yes. You're a so prophet. He never used a word a Rahman before. So he was answering them. So he said to them, I call him Allah or I call him a Rahman. It doesn't matter for all yes. the good names belong to Allah. But this is not the question. Okay. The question right. is, why 50 chapter of the Quran pass and yet Muhammad never used the word a Rahman? Could I answer, please? Go ahead. So Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam he started using the word ar rahman and then the oh, people were saying no. why are you using this name now you used to say Allah mm. and then because the Quran is revealed as revelation from Allah to creator himself mm. Allah replied to his slave the messenger of Allah he said to him tell them to say Allah or tell them to say Allah or ar rahman mm. it doesn't matter to him mm. the name that you, he has 99 names so every name that you call him it doesn't matter even call him the creator mm. whoever you call upon by ever his name any name that you this want is not a question him. abdul are you listening or not are you listening i know that allah he said to him say that this is the response but this is not the question the question yeah. is 50 chapter 50 let me type it for you on the screen because look like you are not listening yeah muhammad he delivered 50 chapters already and this is yeah. the first time and you agreed the first time he mentioned the word ar rahman ever the question is why in the front of every chapter except the chapter of at tawbah it says yeah. bismillahir rahmanir rahim that's mean somebody is adding that because you agreed oh, that this is the oh, first you know no oh. everybody heard you you agreed you said this is oh. the first time he used it everybody heard you because before oh, you, said, you, said, you said you said you said hold on you said you said he never used it before because allah never taught him to use it before no, Bismillah Rahman Rahim is not a Quran ayah. It's just something Allah said. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Bismillah Rahman Rahim is not a Quran ayah. So what it is? Bismillah. You can read the Quran without saying Bismillah. I'm asking Rahim. you. No, it is ayah. Here we go. What, what are you talking about, Abdul? Everybody is laughing. So why you? Why you? Oh, why you? Here we go. Hold on, hold on. Every, everybody is laughing at you. So why you put it here? Here we go. Is that number verse number one? Why you are say, Why you are counting it verse number one? Could I answer, please? Uh, I'm asking you, why you count it as a verse if it's not a verse? No, listen, you know, before you eat, you say in the name of God. That's another That's question. Like so are you saying to me, you add it in the front of every chapter, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, but yes, the fact Allah never said six. that. You agree in that? Oh, guys, do you hear it? The Muslims, oh, they, added, six, they yes. added this verse in the front of every chapter, but it's Allah never said verse. that. So if it's not a verse, how you put it in the Quran? If it's not a verse, why you put it in the Quran? Could I answer, please? <laughs> your, your views are going to know you're not letting me answer. Could I answer? No, I'm letting you answer. I'm asking you why you added there. You said to me before we do things, we have to say in the name of Allah, but this is a fabrication because it's not you who is doing that now. It is Allah he who said, said that the Quran, the Quran supposedly is the word of God. If your God did not say in the name of Allah, you don't say in the name of Allah. He Cross said that if he said that you say that if he did not say I who are you to add it how you add you you agreed and everybody heard you that in the front of the in the Quran there is no in the name of Allah the most merciful Ar Rahman Ar Rahim we Muslims add it who allow you to add it okay could I answer please right okay listen to me very carefully please Christian Prince please if you have a brain on me please mm. listen the Quran when I pray, I can say Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen. I don't have to say Bismillah. It's like a, it's look, in the name of Allah, everybody knows when we say in the name, they know what we're trying to say. We're trying to say, I read this coming verse or I read this next surah or whatever I'm about to say is going to be in the name of my Lord. So I don't I am not. I'm not asking about what you say. I'm asking you why it's written in the Quran. You can say whatever you want. You can say in the name of the rabbit. I don't care. I am asking you why you add it in the Quran and you give it even a number. Why it is there if Allah never it came said that? Down with the Quran. Not what? 
it came down the Jabil said the no it did not came down with the Quran you just admitted yourself I said to you why Muhammad never mentioned the word of Rahman before you said because he never he, he never have it before Allah he gave him the name so the now Prophet did mention he didn't mention our Rahman before but the people never no. heard him when he mentioned the how, the how, how, hold on hold on hold on guys did you hear this the people never heard him saying the word of Rahman Muhammad he mentioned our Rahman before but nobody heard him so what he was whispering to himself <laughs> No, listen, Muhammad, uh, he was delivering Quran to the people or only hide it himself. What do you mean nobody heard it before? How he received it, yet nobody heard the maid, it. The maid of the Pharaoh said, Bismillah rahman rahim It's not a big problem. Everybody knows what this is. Another means. question. Even you said, even you, you said he said never mentioned it before. You said he never mentioned it before. Everybody heard you. So Muhammad was giving, was giving Quran, but he used to hide it. No, listen, Quran answer, please. Hmm. Listen. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim is something in the beginning of every ayah to, you know, for blessings or to, you know, just for blessings from Allah that I'm about to read Allah's words. So this is another question. You repeat yourself. I, I, you answered that already. And I told you, I am not asking broken. you why you say that. I'm not asking you why you say that. I am not asking you why you say that. I'm asking you why you add that to the Quran. It's not something added, it's something from Allah Himself. You just said, you just said, we say that. So, and you said it's not from the Quran, and now you are saying it's from the Quran. No, okay, it's okay, not, as no, long as it's not. from the Quran, let's go back to zero. You see why I hang up on Muslims? They are kids. Listen to me, my friend. I am saying to you, you're a prophet, and you agreed that you said that he, he the reason he never mentioned it before because he never have it before. And then when we check according to Revelation, we found that the chapter of Isra is a chapter number 50. So Muhammad okay. delivered seven, Listen, 50 to chapters you, already. Please, to be honest with you, hmm. I really don't have an answer. I'm going to be honest, okay? Okay. So, okay. For, guys, okay, I, I, I respect your honesty. I respect your honesty. And you have no answer. From the beginning, says that. Why are you argue, Thanks, arguing with me? Please. I ask you a question, please. Okay. Okay. Ask me a question. Go ahead. Do you think, do you think Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam wrote the Quran? I just want to ask you this, please. No, Muhammad, he did not write the Quran. Muhammad is a collector. Muhammad is uh, some uh, stories from here and there. Uh, but so the, who wrote the Quran? It's Uthman ibn Affan. Whose word is it? Whose word? Not written. Whose word? Nobody knows whose word. This is cannot be from God anyway. I mean, see what I mean? You don't even know whose word it is. Yet you no, say I do not know because God. here we go. Okay, let me show you. Is it, is it the Quran says that this is the uh, uh, the Quran is the statement and the and the says of, of a prophet? Huh? Isn't it the Quran says that this is a Quran made by a prophet? You're talking about Surah Najm. I've memorized the Quran. You're talking about Surah Najm. Doesn't matter. I'm asking you. Does it, say, does it say? Listen. Does it say? Does it say that this is the words of a of of uh, of a noble prophet? Does it say that? No. I had a, uh, this is the Allah. This is Allah's word. Not okay. The Quran word. says the opposite. Let's read together. Chapter eighty-one, verse number nineteen. Hold on, my friend. Hold on. Hold on. Chapter eight, chapter sixty-nine, verse number forty. It says it clearly that this is indeed, indeed, indeed. The speech of a noble messenger. Does it okay, say that? Could I answer that? Does it say that? Yes, it does. Could okay. I answer that? Hmm. Go. Okay. When it's saying this is indeed the word of a noble messenger, it is it is answering what the prophet was saying to his people. They didn't believe him for saying this is the word of Allah. They said you're a liar. And then the Allah responded by saying, No, you guys are lying because whatever he's saying is the word of no, a messenger. This is not what happened. No, we can messenger. go to the book of Asbab and Nuzu. We can go a reference. We see. That they oh, accuse him. My friend, hold on. Stephen. They accuse him that he is stealing the stories of other people before him. He says, <laughs> no, this no, is no, indeed no, my no. speech. <laughs> and this is not a point speech because he was doing Saja. Saja ul Kuhan. You can go and search. Maybe you do not know what Saja means. Do you know what Saja means? No, I don't. Okay, we go to the Hadith and we search for the Saja. Here we go. Saja, Muhammad, he used to do Saja. And what is the Saja? Is making Quran the same as the Arab they used to make Arab uh, songs, which is funny and stupid. Here we go. Min, uh, here we go. Hada ikhwanul Kohan. They accuse him. To, uh, they, he says this is from the speech of the uh, of the of the of the Kohan. The Kohan is like a monks. Uh, the, the Arab they used to have people who speak only in Arabic music. You see it. All of this. It's in the front of you. So Muhammad here. He is saying that he made Quran the same as the Sajjah of the Quran, of, 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 uh, of the Quran, the same as the Sajjah of the Arab. Read it. But you just said Muhammad didn't, it's not Muhammad's word, he said, the Quran. Is, the stories are not his stories. You see, read with me carefully. It says, Allah Messenger said, he was talking uh, 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 in, in a tone, phrases like the tones and the phrases of the desert Arab. Do you see it? 
He's copying their yeah. way. Quran is a copy of the Arab desert, the way they speak. It's, it's not something new. So, wow. Muhammad, this is your prophet agreeing. Your prophet agreeing. Okay, why your prophet saying, I am just speaking the Quran is the same as the Arab desert to speak? Why are you saying that? Why are you Quran agreeing? Is. Huh? Quran answer. Can you read for us? Yes, yes, I'm okay, going to answer it. this. Okay, read for us. Quran read for us and explain what Muhammad is saying here. Why he's he copying the Arab? Who is copying no, no, the Arab now? Who is copying the Arab? Allah or Muhammad? Okay, Quran answer. Uh huh. Okay, you know in the Quran it talks about a lot of stories that are also mentioned in the Bible and the Torah, okay? None of them is true. Wow. What do you mean? Yeah, like uh, in, in, the, in, in, the, in the Quran, uh, Mary is the sister of the Aaron. <laughs> Hold on. Mary, her name is Maryam. She is the sister of Aaron. Her father is Umran. None of this information is true. No, Bintu Imran wa Ukhti Harun. Yeah, Umran is the same, the same name as the father of Moses too in the, in the Quran. So yes, Moses and Harun okay. are the are the siblings of Maryam. Oh, they are the siblings of Maryam. Thank you very much. God, did you hear this? <laughs> I saw the Quran said Ukta Harun. <laughs> I know. So, but this is stupid. Mary and how? Aaron. Mary and Aaron. There's there's a there's there is a thousand year before them. How how Who said how, that? Aaron, how Aaron? How Aaron? <laughs> how do you know that? How do you know that? <laughs> My friend Moses. Moses was in was the uncle of Jesus. No, how do you know that? Give I'm asking evidence. you, according to you, Moses is the uncle of Jesus. Is the uncle of Jesus? You are saying that because you are saying Mary and Aaron and and uh, and, oh. and Moses are sibling. <laughs> Aaron and Moses and Imran and ha and Maryam are all, the Imran is the father of them. Okay, this is what I'm saying. So Jesus is Quran, the nephew okay. of Moses. Where is your proof that they're not siblings? Okay, so you are saying to me the that Bible? okay, you are saying to me that Isa is the nephew of of, of Moses, right? He's his uncle. <laughs> <laughs> you do you do realize you do realize okay, what well, first of all the Quran says Ya Ukta Harun, yeah? Uh -huh. It is not Allah who is saying, it is the people of uh, Maryam that are saying, saying If Allah is God, how come he do not know that no way that Mary, she is the she is the sister of Aaron? <laughs> Where is the proof? What the proof? The, the books? I mean, even you. Okay, let me ask you, according to your Islam, Moses came just like a year before Jesus? Two no, months before was, Jesus? Um, I don't know how many years, but it's a long years. Okay, according to Islam, Moses was in Egypt, right? Um, yes, Egypt okay. Was Jesus Israel. in Egypt too? Did he came with his uncle from Egypt? No, Jesus was in <laughs> Palestine. <laughs> this is why okay, we are saying point? this is why we are saying that Islam is the what's most the Islam is the most silly, point? stupid religion cult if because, saying, because saying everybody is laughing, my friend. No. You can go, you can go rubbish. right now, you can go right now, and everybody. I mean, we're not lying to you, my friend. Go and check. There, there is long period before be, between Moses and the and the and, yes, and yes, Jesus. I know what you're saying. Could I answer, please? Okay. Okay. okay, listen. Yeah, Ukta Harun. Okay, mm -hmm. even if people say this verse is talking about something, you know, because they used to call the son of the back in the day the same name as the that's okay, you can say that. But Allah says bin to Imran. He she is the daughter of Imran himself. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. But who's so Imran? Who's Imran? Kind of, who is that Imran? means your book is who's wrong. Imran? Okay, who's is Imran? Wrong. Who's Imran? Imran? You said to me. That the Quran mentioned the stories is, is is in the Bible too. Okay, let me ask you: Can you show me where in the Bible it says that Mary she have a father? His name is Amran. Mary she had the father. His name is Amran. Yeah, where you get his name from? Muhammad is confused. Bible. You see, all okay. oh, what happened, my friend? All oh, what happened? Your prophet, because he's a he's a he's a he's a false man. He is he, he is learning from the Jews, but he is a stupid. He's not smart. You he thought he thought that answer. Mary she is the sister of Aaron because there is a woman. Her name is Maryam. She is really the sister of Aaron, but this is not the same Maryam. So you're a prophet because he is a fool and because he's a liar. He cut that from the Jews. He put it in his Quran. He made a verse about it. He thought this is the same woman. Could I answer? Go ahead. Listen, Christian priest, you can try to beat around it for a hundred years, but the truth is. Your book is written by 40 men, okay? <laughs> how, how many people wrote your book? Your book, your the, the Bible. Hold on, hold on. How many, how many people written? Men, how many okay? people written so your book? How many, how many people how many people written your book? Thousands? Written my book. Yeah, how many? I'm not talking about written, I'm talking about the word. No, no you are saying to me your book written by 40. Let's say written by hundred. Let's say written by your book. When you say 40, your but book. you know when I say 40, your, I mean your, like hold Matthew, on, hold on. John. No, no, my friend. My book is a book of books. It's not a book. You are being silly now. 
my book, the Bible is the book of books. It's not a book. Yes, we can go open now. We see that there's a book, a book, 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 book. So we have books, not book. So we call the Bible, which is the book of book. It's not the one book. So it's very normal to have many books because there's many prophets. Now I'm asking you, the book you have in the front of you, is that written by Muhammad? Written, but no, it's not written by Muhammad. Thank Salah you very much. Not. Why is not written by Muhammad? It was written down by, on paper. By, I am asking you, it's, why it is not written by Muhammad? Where is the Quran of Muhammad? What are you talking about? You're making yourself sound dumb. I'm what asking you, you isn't it the Quran says that Allah is going to collect the Quran and he is going to recite the Quran? No, Allah he says, I'm going to protect the Quran. No, here we go. Okay, uh, uh, okay. Allah is saying to you, that it is our duty to collect the Quran, not the duty of any man. Why Allah did not collect the Quran? Okay, correct, correct answer. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. When Allah said, I am going to collect the Quran or I'm going to protect this Quran, mm -hmm. it doesn't mean like he's going to collect it with his own. It means he's going to use. Who the said that? Who and... said, who are you to say it's not what he meant? What is the scholars? They we got scholars. You're not a scholar. Okay, show me the scholar who said that. The scholar did not say that. You are lying to me now. Okay, could I, could I say something to you very quick, please? You are saying to me the scholar. They say that the scholar did not say that. Allah Here we go. We can change Allah, any translation. Yeah. We can show you any interpretation you want. Allah said it is on us to recite and to collect the Quran. It is on us. Us who? You're trying to hide the translation now, I can see. I am not hiding. It's in the front of you. This is your Islamic website. You can change to any translation you want. I, for me, I don't have any oh, open translation. Back up. Open it back up. In the front of me, there it says, up. in the front of me, it says, Inna alayna wa Qur'anahu. I speak Arabic. Arabic is my language, not not second yeah. language. So I do but not do need translation. Allah means, do you think Allah means he's going to come down on the earth for himself and collect Abdul, it? Abdul, don't it tell me, do you think, do you think Allah says it is on us to collect the Qur'an? Why he did so not you collect the Quran? Allah, Allah is the word of the Quran. Huh? I'm asking you. Do you, you do you believe Allah, in this? Like do you, you no, I don't believe Allah doesn't exist, but this is a lie. He proven Muhammad to be a liar. Allah doesn't exist. Yeah, who do you believe in then? My friend, when Allah he says, if Allah is exist and he said it is on us to collect the Quran, and he did not collect the Quran, that's means he's a liar. He didn't collect the Quran. It's not him, the one who collected the Quran is Uthman ibn Affan, and he is even burned the other Qurans. He did not yeah, collect Uthman them. Burned. If man burned all the other Quran that people were writing, so we, there can only be one Quran mm. with the dialects, different dialects, because of Allah's will. Allah, He said, uh, burn the other Quran. No, He burned the Quran so people don't get confused. Oh, so you are saying if you have more dialect, the, the people will be confused? Yes, back in the day, yes. But we got seven. We got ah, ten dialects. But, the, but back in the day, your prophet he says no. Your prophet he says. If we don't have seven dialects, my people will be confused. It's not what you are no, saying. No, we have seven dialects now. We have it. No, you don't have Say it. Say what? What do you mean? Give me the seven Quran you have. Where are they? Not seven Quran, seven dialects. Seven dialects are seven Quran, my friend. It is seven because dialect means, do you know what dialect means? Yeah. It's different words. It's different words, different words, different words. In Inna al mu'minina wa inna al mu'minina. Abdul, no, 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 no. This is not. This is not the dialect we're talking about. There's different words, totally different words, and we can show you. We can make just a special time for that. And don't talk about this topic because you do not know. Let me show you. Yes. This is your You're prophet. Right, well, okay. Right. If 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 the difference is just between mu'minina and mu'mininu, why your prophet saying they are not capable of doing it? What the difference? There's no different. Believer and believers is the same. So wh why they cannot handle it? He says, he says here, they cannot, forgive me. My community cannot, they don't have a strength to do so. So he's talking about what? Your prophet was reciting verses totally in a different way. And this is why in the if, Quran. If, uh, they were all revealed by Allah. But okay, I want to ask you a simple, a simple thing before I let you go. Okay. Your prophet was lying when he made Quran or not? No, say yes or no. No. Okay. Why Allah in the Quran says in chapter 2, Verse number 106, nothing of our revelation, we abrogate or we cause to forget, we will make something better or similar. Yes. Why? What does that mean? How Allah will make a better Quran than his Quran? <laughs> what I answer? Are you going to let me answer? Go ahead. Okay, for example, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, mm. let's say he will bring a verse to the, Allah will reveal a verse saying, Oh, Prophet of Allah, this is, I'm just telling you, okay? Oh, Prophet of Allah, if you see anybody stealing, Chop their hands off. Okay, I'm just telling you, okay? Mm. Chop their hands off. And then later on, if poverty comes, Allah will come and say, Oh, Prophet of Allah, 
we will not chop hands off. Let them go. Give them a chance and give them back. There's, no, there's no verse that says that. Because of you know what I'm just trying to explain it to no, you. No, this is a lie. Different. Don't explain to me with lies, my friend. I'm asking okay, you. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, this is. Are you saying to me that this verse is better than this verse? Uh, this is a this is a silly of you to say because Allah words is not. He will bring a better verse. Better, better. What do you mean better? How it's going to be better? Quran is Quran. It will be better of the time that they're living in. No, 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 no. This is not what says. Read carefully with me. None of our revelation we cause to be forgotten, or we, uh, either we make something better or similar. So. How it can be better and how it can be similar. This is silly. And why he calls okay, you to want, forget it if it's going to be similar? I want to answer. Okay. Okay, you're gonna and I'm gonna make it seem like you can understand very beautiful. Okay, let's say the prophet was in Mecca, okay? Mm. You know, in Mecca it's um it's all about, you know, Allah says in the Quran, he says, Waspiro, be patient, okay? Mm. Upon the punishment you have. But later on, when if somebody tried to do the same punishment they did to them when they were weak in Mecca in Medina, this time in Medina, Allah will say, "Fight back against those who fight you." You understand? This is not the question, man. I don't care about what you what you say. I'm saying how Allah. It. This is not the question. You are being silly now. Allah says He says He will cause you to forget the Quran. Why He will cause oh, yes. you to forget that the Quran? Okay, yeah, that's true. Huh? Okay, what can you tell me a verse Allah He caused you to forget? No, I don't know. I'm just saying he can make no, it. No, 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 no. It says none of our revelation we do abrogate or cause to be forgotten. Why Allah want you to make to make or make you forget the Quran? What no, it says none. No, none of our revelation, but we do this, which means any of revelation no, we do. Bad. Abdul, not don't be, don't be don't stupid. No, none here, none here, none here is to right? confirm. Abdul, none here is to confirm. That none of no, our revelation, okay? none of our revelation, do we obligate or cause to be forgotten? But we substitute <laughs> but we something substitute better and similar. So he's saying the none here, the none here so goes to what? None of our revelation we abrogate or cause to be forgotten. What we will do after that? We will give you something no, not better. After that. Huh? Read it properly. You know English. Read it properly. Abdul, I don't have time for stupidity, and you are being okay. stupid now. Sure, sorry. You know I don't want to insult you, but uh, shame on you. Do you want okay, to show you? Do you want to show really? you? The, the, change the translation. Should I translate? I mean, come on, it's very simple. Don't you okay. know English? I do not need English. It's in the front of me in Arabic. Sorry, and it says sorry. Well, I was a bit okay, so you, so I'm saying the truth, right? Okay. So don't tell me you do not know English. So I'm asking you okay. now, how Allah and why Allah will cause you to forget the Quran? What the purpose of this? And then He will give you similar Quran. What the point? Okay, listen. Um, first of all, I'm gonna read it for myself. Can I read it out loud, please? Go ahead. Okay, I want you to understand it. None of our revelations do we abrogate or cause to be forgotten. We don't cause it to be forgotten or we don't abrogate it, but we substitute it. No, 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 he caused to be forgotten. He caused it to be forgotten. <laughs> okay, do you like me to show you the interpretation? Yeah. Hang up. <laughs> <laughs> Great job! <laughs> <laughs> uh,